there are lessons in this odyssey. Don Svangik from the Namgi tribe. That good? Okay. Shares one. You just witnessed one of the wonderful things about canoe journey. You call out for help and people run to help you. As Charlie Tom from the Sarlip tribe describes it. Canoe journey is family. It's more than a quarter century old tradition where indigenous tribes from across the area come together and paddle for days, stopping on different lands along the way to greet various tribes. Step, barnacles, watch your step right here. Right now, yeah. Today, they've arrived at Dash Point. <laughs> there's a healing aspect to it, you know, there's a, a growing aspect to it. There's a learning to push yourself when you think you're tired. I feel like what brought me out here is my passion for pulling because I love it so much. And when I look at that water, it just makes me want to do it even more. At 16 years old, she says this journey reinforces the importance of tradition, of history. Kiana Henry Seat Stutt, Bud at Chud at T, Vincent Henry Sr., Yoh C, Margaret Seymour Henry, Squaw Hud Up Chud to Alt Chud Squawk said. Hi, my name's Kiana Henry. I'm the child of Vincent Henry Sr. and Margaret Seymour Henry. I come from Squawkson Island, and I am from Squawkson Island. Hoi Yoh Chud. Your language is what makes you who you are. It makes and make sure that people know where you come from and who you come from. Tomorrow, everyone will end up on the land of the Puyallup tribe, a little tired, very grateful. That's good for us. That's good for our character. It's good for our soul. It's good for our being. At Dash Point, Jenna Hanchard, King Five News.